In 2007, Kai Ping Diaolo is named as World Cultural Heritage Site by UNESCO for its cultural fusion and as a testimony to a disappeared civilization. Soon, Kaiping government developed tourism in different Daolo village on maintenance and distribute the management to villages and Daolo owners. However, the non-comprehensive tourism guideline on site caused confusing experience for tourists. Often, tourists see at the scenery and thought they are part of the heritage, or the information was chaotic, showing a family history, not Daolo or overseas Chinese. So how can we help the tourist journey to be authentic and organized? From current journey, tourists go through orientation, discovering by themselves, taking photos, then be impressed by the site, and eventually have a memorable visit. These experiences can be categorized as informative activities and emotional engagement of the theme. The face the problem of edit the scenery is obstructed for tourists to experience the authentic Daolo. And the chaotic information is the first level obstacle of Daolo village tourism. The Daolo Ancestry is a traveling environment engineering project to enhance the traveling experience at Ma Jiangleng village. It organized a comprehensive traveling experience through routes and storytelling. Daolo Ancestry consists an underground visitor center for storytelling purpose and directory and map to organize the tour. The directory will be planned in two locations, both near the car parts. Tourists can find the best traveling route according to the location they are at and obtain the map leaflet provided at the directory. Included in the leaflet was a two-sided map, one as village map and the other one is visitor center map. Let's meet the Wang's retired couple on their way to visit Ma Jiangleng Diaolo village. After their arrival of driving travel at a car park, immediately they see the directory and obtain the leaflet. It's their first visit they decided to travel by the suggested traveling route. Through the leaflet, they find out the visitor center was divided into four zones on their way, and they were prepared to enter the first one, overseas Chinese workers. Through the description and exhibit, they see the difficult lives of overseas Chinese. So they move on to the next zone, Gum San Suitcase. At this zone, they have a glimpse on what was in the suitcase of returning overseas Chinese. And they can imagine how bittersweet it feels. When they went to Song 3 against the bandits, they see the maps and documents of banditry in Kaiping and the bandits' clips showing in the filter. They start to understand why Daolo was built. It was because of this history background. They then went upstairs. Beside the artifact they saw, they also tried the stimulate of shooting through the gun holes. Within the gun hole, it stimulate the fight between villages and the bandits. Also, they checked out the imitation of Daolo architectural structure in the zone. Eventually, they create their own Daolo structure through my Daolo application and share their creation with their friends. Then they proceed with their visit on Song 4, East Meet West, to see how the lifestyle of overseas Chinese form in Kaiping. After the visitor center, they use the site map of the distributed leaflet to assist their visit in the village. With Daolo ancestry, Wang's couple is able to have perceived Daolo village as the spirit of Kaiping overseas Chinese. Connect with Daolo emotionally with informative, entertaining, and last but not least, authentic environment.